Hey everybody, it's Kyle the Popwiz coming to you live from the Popwiz headquarters in beautiful LaGrange, Kentucky. If you hear that on my phone, that's me starting to watch party on my own personal page tonight. Uh, Facebook's a little bit slow letting us know that this is starting, so I have to take that into account. But I just started to watch party on my own personal page. And then I just heard Melissa's phone go off. Those are probably all on the same things. As we do every show, we thank StreamYard for helping us put together this great live show. Live with StreamYard is a thing, and we are glad to be a part of the StreamYard family. So we always want to thank them. See some comments rolling in already. William is here. He didn't waste any time whatsoever getting on the show tonight. And uh, I see he says, hi, everyone. See my wife's watching. Melissa's here tonight, by the way. Hi, she's, Kyle. She's off to the side. She's She's here for moral support, <laughs> and she wanted to help out. So, yeah, oh, Melissa's here tonight. Terrific Tuesday. We can't have you being here alone. No, terrific Tuesday. We haven't spent any time together at all today either because you did your own thing today. I did my own thing tonight, and we culminated back in here at the office. Yeah, which is the perfect marriage. <laughs> perfect marriage, right? You go out and do your thing. I go out and do my thing, and we come back at the end of the day. Pretty wild. Perfect. So, um, see, Seth has joined. Thanks for watching, Seth. Uh, we are doing this, the $5 grab bag show tonight. Uh, I started to put $6, but that's the next show. Doing $5 grab bags tonight. We've got Ezra on as well. He says hello. Is Emily out there? That's my question. Because Emily, today's her birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Yeah, happy birthday to Emily. William says hi, Melissa. I won't sing. You won't sing? I won't sing. Not enough drinks in you to sing? <laughs> nope. Well, I think we should get her to sign to, to sing. There is John. How many drinks have you had? So I think I've had none. <laughs> I've had no. I've only had water tonight. That's all I've had. Good. 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 Yeah. That remains to be seen. Or I don't know determined. what I just did, but it didn't share to where I needed it to share. Mm. Mm. I think it was the fault of Facebook or the fault of me. I think it was the fault of me. So William says hi, Melissa. John is hi, on. Man. I haven't I haven't seen John forever. I was thinking about him earlier today. I bet he's been moving. John, are you in the process of moving? Is that where you've been? See, brother John is watching. John still is on every show. I think he comes and checks in on me for a few minutes. But uh, John Wise, I think John was saying he was getting ready to move. So maybe that's where he's been. Emily says she is here. Ezra says they're watching on the main TV on YouTube. It's like we watch our Sunday church services. Yeah, they're watching. Cool. They're watching this big show. How do I look on a big screen? I bet not that great. <laughs> I bet not that great. Uh, wide I'm, lens. Wide lens. Yeah, get the wide lens on today. Thank you for. Uh, I'm for always like, look up, look up. Yeah, I don't look up. I don't look you're, at the camera. Yeah, you're, you look down at your phone to get the messages so you can talk to people. But Ezra says they watch Southeast also. Oh yeah. Yeah, we watch we. We normally watch it at home on the uh, big screen, but we actually go to the Grange campus. Yeah, my, my son's an intern there too. So yeah. It's kind of cool. Yeah, Luke, our uh, son's stepson, I don't know which one of you talking, we're talking about. Uh, he is an intern at Southeast and works at the River Valley campus in Prospect. So, mm -hmm. see Kenny Moore's watching. I see Stacy watching out of uh, Zanesville. The second day back to school for Stacy. I'm sure she's really yeah. thrilled tonight. Hi, Kristen. <laughs> And Kristen's on. Kristen, yeah. Kristen, I remember you from Pro Yeah, Kristen, guess who's in the corner over here? And she recognizes your name. <laughs> it's Melissa. So Kristen always steps, steps in to see, say hi to. So she says, thank you. For, uh, uh, Emily says, thank you for the birthday. And we should sing, 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 but we're not going to do that. And John says, yes, he's been moving. And I haven't been on it. It's a pain. We all know yes. that. We're about, I was about moving earlier today. What a pain it is. I'm glad I don't have to move no more ever again. I don't think. How many times did you move? I moved four times in less than a year. Yeah. And I hadn't moved, but maybe twice in my life before that. It wasn't much. So Ezra and Emily went to the Indiana campus of Southeast until the coronavirus hit. So they're just over in New Albany. I don't know if I've told you about them or not. I think I have. But they're in New Albany, so we'll have to connect at some point. Kristen says, hi, Melissa. Yes, I responded. Okay. It was just a little delay there. 
Yeah, there's always a little bit of a delay. Okay, so you're watching the five dollar grab bag show. You know how this works, right? Five dollar, five dollar. So foot long. Bag. Oh, the guy does the commercials. He goes like this, <laughs> and then he always does little dances, and then he gets whacked away. I like, I like that commercial. You want me to whack you? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I actually went to, I actually went to Subway the other day, and I got frustrated because I bought my food and then sat down and realized I could have gotten two for one if I had just. I paid ten dollars for a sub and a drink. I'm surprised you went there because you said they don't do the low carb stuff. They don't. I just ate the stuff off the bun. Ugh. But I don't, I don't need two of them for that matter. So that's the best part. I'm doing low carb diet. You see me? Wasn't aware. We don't, we don't, I guess we don't want really to talk about that kind of thing. But I'm trying to lose weight. The best thing I can do to lose weight, keep my blood sugar in control, is to do low carbs. So. We're doing the five dollar grab bag show. We're going to go to random.org right now. We're going to find out what numbers go to who. Melissa's over here clapping. She's excited. Is everybody else excited too? I hope you're excited as well. Um, so here's to the order based upon the orders of. Um, I guess it's asking. You have to ask a question about this too. Ezra and Emily, do you guys want your guys to split up in like ten and five, or how do you want them split up? And I've got William doing the first four. Then I've got I got down as Ezra doing ten. I've got uh, Emily bought a lot. <laughs> uh, I see. Em I got Emily down for five. I'm I don't know where I dream that up at, but uh, but yeah. So if you want that different, then all together, all together. So we'll do all together. It'll be all together anyhow. But anyway, so I got Bill with one, not William, but Bill uh, Martin, and then I have William following up with another five because he had two orders, but one at the beginning, one at the end. See Wendy Sowers online. Glad to see Wendy on there. Wendy's running for office in Zanesville. Very proud of her. She's a former classmate of mine at West Muskingum High School. Oh. She's running for court courts in Zanesville, so I'm excited about that for her. Kathy Chapman's watching. I always got to have Kathy on board as well. So I'm going to share my uh, screen here with random.org, and uh, you can follow along with me if you'd like. You can watch us pick our numbers. I've already got the screen up on here, as you can see. We've got random.org, a sequence between 1 and 25 on one column. And we're going to go ahead and run that right now and get our numbers. And here we go. Okay, so these are the numbers. So we've got, uh, let's see here. Let me get my pen. William has 7, 14, I'm sorry, 7 and 4. And 17 and 24. Ezra and Emily have the next 15. Probably easier to do the ones from the bottom. <laughs> William has the last five, so he's got nine, one. There's 14. He's going to get 14 regardless. Six and 25. Bill has number 10. And that leaves the rest in between there for Ezra and Emily. So from 24 down, and that goes from or 7, 14, yeah, 24 down. So 21, 15, 19, 12, 20, 22, 5, and 16, 8, and 18, 13, 23, 2, and 3. And 11. Let's count those off for Ezra and Emily. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Got it. We got it exactly correct. So we're going to do William first. I'm going to go ahead and remove that screen from there. Is everybody excited about this? Let's go, William. Let's go. Let's go. William's going to be the first four. Okay, let me get these screens off here real quick. Let's see what's been said. So William says he's ready. <laughs> They're all together. They're ready. I'm so not these I need a. Uh, I need number seven, number four. Okay, don't go too fast. Can we do one? Ask me questions. Okay. So okay. Melissa's pulling these off. Seven and four, and seventeen. And 24. Okay. 
Yeah, Ezra's know. like, drum roll, please. <laughs> yeah. You hear that in the background? There's our drum roll. <laughs> not, not a very good band. So what's the number seven? Seven. Bit of lies, Daredevil. Ooh. Number seven. The Venomized Daredevil. I'll put the sticker on top. William, here's your first one. John's is excited for everybody. It's probably the first time John's not actually had something in the show. Okay, his first one for you, William, from Venom. Marvel's Venom, number 513, the Venomized Daredevil. That's the first one for you tonight, William. Venomized Daredevil. Of course, there's a six net series. Just six of them. We've had most of them on this show, I feel like. But if you need help getting any of those, let me know. That's your first one. What's number four? Minimized Miles Morales. I'm seeing a pattern here, William. <laughs> Another Venomized. Ooh. Venomized Miles Morales. From Spider Man, number 600 in the series. That's your number four. Melissa's excited about your next one, I think. Well, I don't know number 17 oh yeah so that's that one it's amazing how they kind of go together you know this is another spider-man one another spider-man minimize dr strange williams like sweet so, so you actually got three uh, the, the first four you got here you've actually got yeah. three of the four are venomized so you got the venomized dr strange from spider-man how cool is that that's crazy number 17 and then the last one that Williams got in this uh, set of four is number 24. And remember, if you want to buy in for the next show, it's $6 a pop. The pictures are on the website at thepopwiz.com. Uh, I've already sold six spots for this, so there's 19 left to go. My math is still pretty good, I think. So if you're interested in buying that one, we'll schedule the show as soon as, as, soon as um, we sell all 25 of them. Number 24, this is the last one of your first set. William, I know you got four on this and you got five at the end. Thor from Marvel, number 381. Number 381. You ain't too bad there. You got a lot of Marvel stuff in there, buddy. Not too bad. Congratulations. You got this nice Thor. Okay. So that's all four of William's first ones. Ezra's like, we want some soda. Curtis T, he's online. Curtis T, he did. He's been on the news today. Yeah. That's right. I heard about that. You run the news today, Curtis T. Okay, my next one. We have I dinner need, with him tomorrow. We do. We're having dinner with him and his wife, Claudia, tomorrow. Did you say yum yum or meow meow? Yum yum. No. Well, then yum meow or home with the new kitten. <laughs> Ezra's saying they want some of those sodas, which, you know, I told someone earlier today, assume those are all commons. There may be a surprise or two in there, but let's assume they're all comments. I don't want everybody to think that they're um, going to get some massively amazing stuff in there. There may be. There may be some non-commons in there, but let's assume they're all comments. Okay, the first one for Ezra and Emily, number 21, which is right here in front of me. So I can get that one. Next one, that's number 15, if you want to try to find okay. it. Number 21, Ezra. Under Sea Gal from Disney, number 601. I'm hoping you don't already have this one. You may have gotten it earlier. I've had like five of these, and uh, I've been in every show. So you may have already gotten one of these. I hope not. If so, you've got two of them now. <laughs> this one makes me hungry. Uh-oh. I haven't had these in a long time. Oh, number 15. Now, this is funny. I think, I think you've already got one of these, too, actually, Ezra. I think you got one of these the other day. Number 15 is Twinkie the Kid, the non-chase Twinkie the Kid. I have the chase one if anybody's interested in it. I'd be more than happy to sell it to you. Someone's asked about my Black Panther. I actually sold the Black Panther this afternoon. I had three people interested to look to the third one, and um, they got a pretty good deal on it. I started selling some pre-orders for the next series that come out in January of 21. If you're interested in any of those, they are simply 1919 on the site. Um, you have to get those through eBay as well, through me as well. Doing pre-orders, you got one in six chance to get the chase. 
The chase right now is going for seventy bucks. So wow. if you you could buy the whole case if you want. So, sad about. It. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's pretty bad. So I think the first two that Ezra got, I think he's already got. To be honest with you, so we're right. batting we're batting zero for for whatever. But at least he's got a couple of them now. Now they can fight them over them at home. So next one. <laughs> Next one is number 19. Number 19. And then 12 follows it. It's right there. Number 19. I feel a theme of venomized stuff. Check this out. Number 19. Venomized. Thanos. Number 510, the series. I don't know if you have that one or not. This one's pretty cool. It's got. Uh, Mama's happy for 19. She already probably knew what she got. She wanted him. So Emily said she wanted this one. She's been oh, had good. this one picked out. Birthday girl got what she wanted yeah. for her birthday. We love it when people love it. Like yeah, that. I prefer you get what you want, actually. So you got that one. You already picked that out, knew that was coming. Number 12, Melissa. And then Big after Portman. that is number 20. Number 12. You may have heard Melissa say it's Jake Portman. What show is that from? Oh, the Mrs. Is it Peregrines. Yeah, it's Mrs. Cool. Peregrines. Peculiar Children. I have a hard time saying that one. Peculiar. Yeah, the movie. Peculiar. Jake Portman, number two sixty in there. Peculiar. Yeah, I can't say it very it's like easily. Worcestershire. Sour. <laughs> I'm not going to say how I say it usually. <laughs> Uh, who gives a, and then Which give it to me. So you got that one. Hopefully you're excited about that one. Hopefully. Um, what number did I tell you? 12? Yeah. No, oh, 20. 20. 20. 20. And then 22 is next. It's Psycho. Psycho. I can't make my Psycho jokes I normally make here. I had one yesterday, so it's female Psycho. I'm like, I think I've had a few of those in my life. Mm hmm Borderlands, number what's that? Ditto. Ditto. <laughs> Borderlands number forty. Present company excluded. I was about to ask. Present company excluded. That nah, of course so. Uh, number forty five from Borderlands. You got this one. It's Psycho. I like the I like looking these kind of things. That's it's just a lot of handy work. Looks kind of cool to me. Mask. Wearing a mask. Nobody. Nobody. Yeah. Covidy. John says happy birthday, Emily. Uh, Say so twenty-two. I, did I tell you that yeah. one. Nope. Twenty-two and then good. number. I think you've already got this one. Really? That's okay. Yeah, I've had several uh, of these. I think they've already got them. I forget. Was this an '80s show? Because I remember watching it, but dinosaurs. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I kind of think. I guess maybe late. 80s, early 90s, maybe? I don't know. I'm trying to think about when it was. I mean, it really wasn't my childhood. I know that. No, so, so maybe it was my kid's childhood. But yeah, I think it's a little later than what you're thinking. Okay. From Dinosaurs, the television show, Earl Sinclair, and I'm pretty sure you've already got this from earlier in the week. Now you got two of them. Number five, Melissa. We've got Star Wars. Ezra says he remembers the show. IG-11. Oh, yeah. The Star Wars one, number five. Number 328 from Star Wars Mandalorian, IG-11. IG-11. I think that one's pretty cool, too. I am not a big Star Wars fan, I have to admit. I know. I'm not... Verse in it, should I say? But, but you I have all. seen all. Well, You've seen them all at some point or another. But you have not. Even I've seen, seen one. The whole first one, have you? No, I've amazing. seen. I've seen whatever number four was. That's crazy. I think I was dragged to the movies to see it by some friends. I don't know why. They yeah, had even had to drag you. Like yeah. it was just Phantom Menace. Is that was it? Phantom Menace. I think it was number four. I think that's the one I've seen. Phantom Menace. I've just. I do think the characters are cool, and I'm, I'm getting, I, I know more about them than I used to, but I'm not a big fan. Yeah. I see Shay watching. 
Shay's another uh, good pop dealer from uh, Louisville, Pops oh. Comics. Owner of Pops Comics is watching. We're glad to have like, Shay uh, on. Poplar, yeah, Preston Highway area? Or? Yeah, the one we go to over okay, by, yeah. by your daughter's house. That's a nice yeah. store. Yeah, it's a nice store. But Shay's watching. Uh, number 16. Wallace. Number 16. It's Wallace from Blade Runner 2049. Wallace. You ever seen that show? You ever seen that movie? What is it? Blade Runner 2049. Wasn't uh, the most popular one. Probably not. Probably not. Hmm. Connie's watching. Unless, like, back in the day, somebody would have made me go see that. So I was talking about Shay having a store there in Louisville, Pops Comics, and he's watching right now. And Connie's watching. Connie has a YouTube channel. Uh, Connie's, I'm going to miss, I'm going to miss say it. Connie's everything about Funko and Disney. I think oh, something like that. Cool. Got a YouTube channel. She did a, one of our mystery boxes here recently where she unveiled it and uh, checked the prices, make sure I was legit. And, uh, <laughs> You know, I mean, I actually the prices were down a little bit from where I sent from when I originally bought them. That's always the trouble with saying when do pop price get prices, but sure. it was it would be like forty seven dollars. I remember right, but yeah, Connie has a great little channel. If you've not checked her channel out, uh, she's a customer and she uh, has a great channel as well on YouTube. Uh, Connie loves uh, Disney and uh, Funkos. Connie, if I got that wrong, tell us the exact channel name so I'll make sure we promote it to everybody else. So. Glad to have Connie on here tonight as well. Okay, where are we at here? That was number 16. Number 8. Number 8. Oh, it's in my hand. It's in your hand. Well, that's a good Captain place for it to Marvel be. Captain Marvel 437. Another Captain Marvel? Now, this one, I would have no clue. Like, <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> no clue. Well, it's kind of cool. This is one of the ones I like the best of the series that we have in here. So we've got number 8. Uh, it's from Captain Marvel, Carath. 2019 Spring Convention Limited Edition. I actually have two of these sitting here. So you hopefully you don't get both of them. But you definitely got one of them. So that's kind of a cool one, cool one for you to get. Number 18, Melissa. It's right there, actually. There's a lot of Marvel stuff in this bunch. Wasn't there? I, didn't realize, I didn't realize how much Marvel stuff I had in this uh, bunch of things. Number 18. Ant Man, Ant Man from the Wasp and the Wasp, Ant Man and the Wasp. Ant Man, I don't I like it. He's kind of cool. With so, you got that one. Um, let's see, number 13, Melissa. Okay. If you're out there watching, you know, you can buy for our next show. It's a Marvel again. At the pop popwiz.com oh, search for cool. grab bags, you can do our six dollar grab this bag one show. Glows in the dark. Oh, yeah, this one's flirt. Make sure he's don't say that wrong. Number 13, it's a goose lurking. <laughs> Captain Marvel, number 445, that glows in the dark. Turn the lights out and see how it glows in the dark. But I'm not going to do that. So, you got that one too. Fun. Oh, I could. I like to turn off the lights and turn off everything else somehow or screw something else up. We had a power problem here yesterday, actually. Um, next door neighbor uh, oh. was running two hair dryers at the same time. And went, ding. Oh. Well, but, we had it at my office, too. From Really? Well, that was, no, actually, that was Sunday from 10 to you know, 5 a.m. to 10 a.m. They were out of electricity. I remember seeing that There's online. just some weird stuff going on. It's 2020. Yeah. <laughs> WTF number 23. If you're still watching Emily and Ezra, you guys still excited? I think Emily already took pictures that shows what she's already knows what she's getting, actually. Oh, really? Yeah, I think she already saw. She got her numbers she's been comparing. I bet you. Cool. Another Captain she's Marvel awesome. item. Captain Marvel itself also glow in the dark. You can't beat this. You're doing it. You're doing well. You guys are doing well. Number two. Beats. 
and Melissa they're still watching. I forgot they're watching <laughs> on a big screen TV. Thank God I'm not on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already big enough without being the big screen. <laughs> number two, from, from Fantastic Beast, number six in the series, Seraphinia Pickery. That's how I pronounce it. I'm not sure if it's exactly right or not. Number six okay. in the series. John's like, nice pop so far. I agree. We've, they've done some pretty good jobs here. Number two. Um, number three. These are all the Aww. ones that Emily and Ezra got. Aww. I said, nice is a nice one. So cute. You'd keep this one, wouldn't you? If you were collecting, you would keep this one. Yeah. Number three is Piglet. Number 615 in the Disney series, Piglet. I did I did my kids' nursery and Pooh Bear and stuff, so yeah, I would definitely. And one of them, I have like a lot of Christmas ornaments, so that would definitely be one that I would have. Yeah, I was always into the Winnie the Pooh stuff. Yeah. Well, we have friends that got all of the Frozen Pops because they're a little girls yeah. are into Frozen, so they decorated their rooms with you know, all the Frozen Pops. So that was really cute. Well, their dad actually sent me a message when he got them in the mail. I, I, I procured them all for him. And he's like, uh, hey, he's like, I'm taking them all out of the box to, to put around the room. Is that right. like sacrilegious? I'm like, it's okay. Yeah. It is what it is. Save the box if you want. But the ones he had, most of them aren't going to go for value, I don't think. Well, you never know. But yeah. it's hard to tell. But I, Kind of suspicion that they're well, my grandmother out. collected antique dolls and she did the same thing. It was like, I mean, there's a different cost, like, she would dress them and they wouldn't have an original box, but they still were worth something, you know. Right. But they were worth more to her because it was her hobby and she enjoyed them, right? Rather than just leaving them set, you know. So, I, it just depends. On Ezra the says that Emily is pretty excited about that pop. Oh, good, big look, Disney. Uh, let's see. Ezra said his 3D printer's been going nonstop since last night making <laughs> pop shelves. See that? Yeah. Oh, so you can have Trey make you some shelving. Yeah, I have Trey. I have I have group guy make us some shelving. I would love that. You, you would like that a lot, wouldn't yes. you? Yes. Can we do that all behind you? That'd be awesome. Some shelving. We got one more pop in Ezra and Emily's uh, group here. It's number eleven. Drum roll, please. Number 11. All right. It's a Marvel. It's a Big surprise. It's another Marvel. Number 11. Maria Rambo. Captain Marvel. Number 430. Number 430. That's all 15 of you guys' pops. And Melissa's already sitting here scratching her head out. She's going to send 15 pops all at the same time. But we'll figure I it all out tomorrow. I just love looking for boxes. Look, looking for boxes <laughs> that size. and keep them before they don't break. All no. that kind of thing. But we got about 20. It's what did I tell you? 20, I think there's 21 orders to fill as we sit here still. Okay. That we'll get through them tomorrow. We're not complaining. No, I'm not complaining at all. I love it. I, I really okay. do love it. It's a, it's a good uh it's a good thing. Ezra's joking about all the Marvel stuff. He's almost got a complete set now. Yeah, just in buying those. He's right. talking about teasing. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so I don't know if Bill's on or not. Uh, Bill Martin got uh, one spot in the show. Thank you, Bill. First time customer, by the oh, way. Yay, welcome, Bill. And uh, if Bill is on or not, I'm not sure. But he got number 10, which I think is sitting right here in okay. front of me. So we're going to show you what uh, Bill got in number 10. Number 10 for Bill. And what did Bill get? He got Wasp from Ant-Man and the Wasp. So we had Ant-Man we had the Wasp. We had both mm -hmm. of them. There's actually a third one in that series. What it's does Ghost. Bill collect? You know? I don't know. Yeah, That's a first-time customer. Yeah. I've not seen him cool. on here. But, uh, but yeah, Bill uh, is a first-time customer. He bought this the other day. So he got that one. And now, William, we're back to you again. Are you still on, William? Emily says it's time to order some more. <laughs> That's always good to let us know. You know, like and share the video if you would, please. Keep us going. Yeah, and absolutely. Let us know. Let us know what you're into as far as collect anything or collect something specific or.
talk back and forth. You can even trade back and forth if you yeah. wanted. After we have you got the, something. Yeah. We have the buy sell group in there for that yeah, reason. If you cool. guys want, and it's actually funny you mentioned that because uh, Ezra just mentioned that Emily would prefer to have the Wasp um, rather than Ant Man. Mm-hmm. Or yeah, yeah. So if Bill wanted to trade for Ant Man, she'd be more happy to take the Wasp. Okay. So that's a good point. So you mentioned it, and then it actually happened right in front of us. So William, are you on? Yes, he is on. Okay, okay, here we go. William, we got five more for you. They're all his. They're all his. Everything's his. We're going to start with <laughs> number nine. Okay. Oh, well, that, that just came out, didn't they? Yep, just came Does out. I don't know. I can't remember, but Bill's been buying some stuff. He may already have this. If he does, he now has two. He's got a Ronald McDonald. I remember you saying those were just coming out. Yep, I got the case of them the other day. and. We've used them I almost haven't all. Seen the other ones, though. I haven't seen any. The other ones there. haven't 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 come oh, out yet they here. Haven't? Nope, they're supposed to all been here in August, and the only one I've seen so far is this oh. one. There's also a five pack out there that's gone for. Yeah, I money. wanted to see the hamburger and Mayor McCheese, Grimace. Officer Big Mac. You know, I didn't even didn't Grimace. even know there was a Mayor McCheese. <laughs> <laughs> I think I am the Air Mayor McCheese. <laughs> oh, so what Emily's saying? She preferred to have. She'd like to have Ant, Ant, Ant Man, and a Wasp, but she'd trade some other pops for a Wasp. If you can see her comment, and I'm not sure that she's actually even on tonight, but if we make contact, we'll, we'll let him know. Okay, so that's number nine. Number one. Number one. Oh no, Game of Thrones. Oh, wait, so that's his first Ron McDonald. So oh, he has yeah. not got another Ron McDonald. So that's good. Well, William, you know you can't just stop with just one. You're going to have to buy some others. You're going to have to get the Grimace and Mayor McCheese and all that. I'm just teasing it. But he was just taking a chance. I mean, yeah, he was, was taking a chance. Yeah. And, and we'll have the others in here. In fact, I got in today. I got in a second run of um, Smokey the Bear. And they're in the next series, the $6 hmm. uh, boxes. So those just came in today. Uh, filled all my orders and I've got some left. So. Next one you got is from Ghost. It's Ghost, actually. Number one. Ghost from Game of Thrones. Which is ironic because there's a ghost in, yeah, there's a ghost in Wasp, too. The Tots may be a two pack. Oh, yeah. The, there's the French fries, a bunch of the fry guys. That's yeah, coming out, too. The fry guys. And that's not on the box. No. Like, it's actually a two pack. It's come out separate. Okay. I forget which retailer has it. Um, it's not coming out direct to like my wholesalers. So, okay, so we're on number 14 now, William. And you might already have this one. But I've had several of these too. So I apologize in advance if you do. But now you've got another one. Dark Voyager, Fortnite, if you have this one. And you got two of them. Dark Voyager. Got two more to go, William. And that'll be the night. William likes ghosts, so that's perfect. I'm great. So let's do number six first. Oh, man. Most is all put out because she had the other one in her hand. Oh, man. Cheer. Oh, man. Number six, it's Skeleton from Minecraft. I don't know if you're a game player or not, but this is one of the cool ones, in my opinion. Skeleton from Minecraft. And before I wrap up the show, I want to remind you, if you want to buy the $6 grab bags, there's about six of them sold out of the 25. The rest of them um, are still available for sale. Yeah, William had that one, the Fortnite one, I think. I was afraid of that. But you can do that right now. You can get before you forget because it'll sell out overnight. I'm almost guaranteed of it. Um, we have customers looking at them constantly. And uh, it just takes a few of them to buy them to be all gone. Thepopwiz.com. Go to the search bar and type in grab bags. You know, come up with a $6 grab bag. You can see the pictures of what's going to be in the grab bags. When we sell all 25 of them. We'll do a show. It could be as early as tomorrow night, but it might be Thursday night. Who knows? Don't know. Never know. Okay. Tell I Bill <laughs> Tell Bill Emily really wants wasp. He can PM me or anything. So 
Bill's not on, so I don't, I don't, I don't even know Bill. I just he bought this bag. That's all I really know. So John says that's nice. One more left, and we already actually had one of these earlier tonight. Ezra the got one, one too. Ezra, yeah, I got two of the same one. Ezra got one too. <laughs> Emily says Ezra's ordering more spots, more grab bags right now. <laughs> Number twenty-five. Last but not least, we had another one in the shop, and I'm glad that two people, the, the two of them, didn't go to the same person. From Captain Marvel, Carafe, the 2019 Spring Convention Limited Edition, and that is the show. We will get all these shipped Bye out much. hopefully tomorrow, if not by Thursday. Got some other orders to fill in there too, about 21 total, but we'll get them all. Uh, we'll get them all filled out and uh, out. And then it is up to yeah. I will tell you, <laughs> yeah, the mail system is horrible. I am using UPS right now rather than USPS right. for this stuff, which is helpful. Yeah. Um, I will tell you all that we will not be in the office on Friday. I'll still be doing some work from here and there, but if you're a horse fan at all, you know this is like a like a major <laughs> holiday in Louisville, the Kentucky Derby, which is normally in May. It's going to be a Labor Day weekend, and we're going to be busy with that on Friday and Saturday here in Louisville. So we will not be in the office on Friday at all. Watching at it all. from. You're watching it from some TVs, no, big TVs somewhere. No fans allowed. Yep, no fans allowed at the Derby, but we'll still be celebrating like everybody else celebrates in the Louisville area. So. Have a little bourbon. Yep, bourbon and horses. That's what Friday and Saturday are all about. Derby pie. Kind of starts Thursday night around here, really. There's Derby. Derby. But there's Derby. Well, there's races all week, but Derby, and then Oaks Day, and then Derby. Were you telling me the main horse, the horse that was favored, was knocked out of the race today? I heard that. I guess there's a. Well, I don't know if it was the favorite, okay, but one I know of the it favorites. was up there because it was in the people that have it are like Prospect to Oldham County people. Gotcha. And something happened, so they pulled. They pulled it today because it. It's okay. So one of the or something pulled. got hurt. So, but um, he was a another one is a long shot. But of course, the people get pulled. But um, I like long shots. So, uh, the Foley horse, but a major major fed major fed is That's probably going to get like. one of my bets just because I know the. When you say one the wife of your, of the trainer. Yeah. When you say one of your bets, is this a bet I'm going to make with your name attached to it? Or is this a bet well, that make? always works best. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> uh, no Melissa, loss, nothing but gain. Melissa doesn't I place her it. own bets. <laughs> she just tells me where to bet. I like to bet on horses. Probably a little too much. I but, actually, I, I get a little excited around Derby time, and I'll bet for a while for the races, then I give up. <laughs> and once in a while, if I'm in a Around here, if what's you're in a yours restaurant, is mine and what's yours is mine. I made that mine joke. Is yours? I made that joke earlier. <laughs> day with your son. <laughs> oh, you did. Yeah, <laughs> we made that joke earlier tonight. Um, whenever I see a horse race in a restaurant or bar around here, I always bet on the race because around here we can bet with our apps. Yeah. So it's pretty cool. Okay, Emily says her numbers are two seven and nine always. So oh. if we're going to bet a trifecta, we got to bet two seven and nine for Emily. We're going to split with you if you win, I suppose. <laughs> Who knows? William says he's happy with his pops. So I'm very awesome. glad to hear that. I'm glad to hear that, guys. Yeah. Uh, we're trying to do this as much as I can. Um, I'm running out of things to put in there without raising the price. That's why the price keeps going up. But um, but we'll keep going as long as I can. So, yeah, Emily says, yes, please bet that. Hope you win big. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, everybody, we are out of here. We're going to call it a night. We're ready to go home. I'll be back at it very early tomorrow morning uh, here at the office. If you guys need anything, you always can message me. You can always uh, have me, uh, like I just got a message from Ezra, just invoice me. <laughs> so um, so we'll do that. So if you're interested in any of these spots, uh, let us know as soon as possible. I have a feeling they're going to sell out before the morning. So, again, thanks for watching the show. We'll catch you on the flip side. See ya. Sayonara.